Maybe you're burning out drinkers. Ugh, I'm in hell. Hey, Spartacus! My wife is really sick! Come on, I know you can hear me! Just forget it. Maybe his English is limited. What's Greek for Spartacus? Just give it up. Me? Give up? Never. Is there anything that I can do to make you more comfortable? You can drop the Concerned Spouse Act. It's making me gag. It's not an act. <laughs> Come on, Spanky. One day we'll laugh about this. Or not. You thought I forgot. Forgot what? Happy anniversary. It's not our anniversary. It was one year ago today that the stingy IRS threw you in here. For tax evasion. And fraud. You defrauded the tax man and left me holding the bag. Well, it hasn't been a picnic for me. I've had to travel alone to Rio and London and Hong Kong. On my dime. Oh, I was going to tell you about that. Your dimes are gone. I had to cash in the ELQ stock. But you know, I found this fantastic spa in Bali where they have Cabana Girls. Oh, look at the time. I would love to stay and make this a conjugal visit, but I haven't got a minute to spare. Got to get to the airport. Got a flight to Buenos Aires. And you know how Sky hates to be kept waiting. And what about me? How long are you going to let me rot in this place? Well, don't worry about yourself. I just hired the best criminal attorney in the world, and here she is now. Oh, yeah. Hands off! The old ball and chain is chained. Don't worry about her. <laughs> Welcome back. You ready for some water? I got your ball and chain. You have cheated on me for the last time. <sighs> Usually, when you accuse me of cheating on you, it's the beginning of a really good, healthy fight. It's really a buzzkill when you go all limp after a couple of threats. I get my strength back, you're dead. Why are you so hostile? Uh, I had a nightmare that I was thrown in jail by the IRS because of your double dealings. Imagine that. <laughs> the IRS, huh? <coughs> Sounds like my nightmare. <coughs> well, we got to get you out of here. <sighs> I'd kill for a martini. <coughs> Do you remember when I poisoned your martini? Yes, and I framed you for murder. My murder. Yeah. What sweet memories. That's the day I knew it was going to last. <coughs> so don't let some crazy dream throw you. It was just a crazy dream, right? <sighs> no. Well, I might have gotten a little creative with the taxes this year at the Haunted Star. How creative? Now look, don't worry your pretty little head about it now. If the IRS gets hip to my fuzzy math, then I seriously doubt they will. Hey, they're not going to find us in here. 